This video will show you how to determine if a book is available in McCain Library. To do so, you want to go to the library homepage, agnescott.edu slash library. And in the middle of the page, you see a tab for books. This will search WorldCat, our library catalog and it will bring back results that are print books, ebooks. Uh, we also include some articles, but this is probably not the best way to search for articles. For that, you want to use other resources. This is just the best way to find out whether we have a book or a DVD in the collection here at McCain Library. So if I wanted to see what we have about Nigerian fiction, I could type in these keywords, Nigeria and fiction, and it will show me things that are available in lots of different libraries. If I only want to see things that are available at McCain Library's Agnes Scott College collection, I can limit things on the left. You'll see limiters for my library publication year, format, whether you want a print or an ebook, language limiters, and so forth. So here I have options for things that are available in McCain Library. If I wanted to know more about this particular item, if I click the title, it shows me some subject tracings. It shows me it's available as an electronic book. It also gives me a Google preview and lets me share or save things to a list. But if I know I want, for example, a print book, I could keep scrolling. Here's another uh, online book. This particular one, Magical Realism and West African Fiction, is available as a hard copy book on Stack 2. And I see a list of letters and numbers here. This is like an address for the item in the book. In the building it's called a call number. So I would want to find the PR part of the collection, which is literature. If I were not sure where Stack 2 is, again on the library homepage under Services and Spaces, I see a link to Library Floor Maps. If I click there, I see a greater explanation of our arrangement, the classification system, if I needed to know how things are arranged on the shelves. I also see that the PRs are on Stack 2, and this link will show me exactly what that looks like. So if I take the elevator up to S2, I would wander this, this part of the building, this floor. I also could get it uh, by going up the back stairwell to stack two and then finding the item and bringing it down to the checkout desk on floor one to borrow it. If I were looking for something that were not available here, let me uncheck that and show you. If I wanted this book by Nadine Gordimer, You'll see it's available at other libraries, but it doesn't immediately pop up as being here at Agnes Scott. If I click on that title, I have a way to access our interlibrary loan service, which is a free way for you to borrow a book from another library. And this would seamlessly let you tell us the last date that it would be useful to you if you need to put in any notes about, for example, a particular edition of a book or a particular chapter that you're looking for. You could put a note here. If you fill in your name and email address and your Agnes Scott ID number and whether you're a student or faculty member or staff person, and then submit, just watch your email and we will let you know when it's available. If you have any other questions while you're searching, you can email the library here. And at most afternoons, you would also see a chat box that would come up here when you could ask an immediate question over chat. 
if you were not in the building. If you are in the building, you're welcome to come talk to us at the Research Help Desk, and we'll be glad to help you find something. And staff at the Circulation Desk or Student Assistant are also happy to go up in the stacks if you're having difficulty finding something. I hope that helps you determine whether or not something is available in the collection. Do feel free to ask us if you need more help.